Who is Hashem really speaking to? At the beginning of Parashat Tzaveh, in the first five verses, Hashem poses a question to Moshe, Ve'ata, now you. First of all, now you, says Hashem to Moshe. <laughs> See to it, please, that there will be people who will be responsible for the daily kindling of the light of the menorah. Now you see to it as well that there will be Kohanim who will be the spiritual leaders of the people. Now you as well, Hashem said to Moshe, ensure that there will be sufficient people to build and to furnish the Mishkan, the sanctuary of the people. Both Ramban and Sephora no comment that Hashem was purposefully saying to Moshe, Ve'ata now you, in order that he shouldn't think, ah, I'm the leader of the people, so I can stand aside and watch other people doing the job. No. Whoever you are, in whatever capacity you work, you need to be personally involved. Interestingly, Parshat Tetzaveh stands out as a sedra in which Moshe is the central character, but his actual name does not appear within the parsha. It's as if Hashem is purposefully avoiding mentioning his name. And therefore, I'd like to suggest that the Va'atah is an intention to go beyond the person Moshe. And rather, Hashem is sending a message to each and every one of us throughout all ages. Va'atah, what about you? We must ask ourselves, are we kindling lights? Are we an inspiration to others? Perhaps you are like the Kohanim. You're a leader. You're the chairman of an organization. You're starting initiatives. You're saying to others, follow me. Or perhaps you're one of the builders, ensuring that institutions or buildings or facilities within our community are there for others, and you're interested in furnishing and keeping them running. Whatever it might be, the Atta calls upon us to ask ourselves the question, what is it that I am actually doing? The very first question that Hashem posed to a human being is featured in Parshat Breshit in the Garden of Eden when Hashem called out to Adam and he said to him, Ayaka, where are you? That first question continues to be the eternally valid and most relevant question Hashem poses to each and every one of us. Ve'ata. Hashem was not only speaking to Moshe, He was addressing each and every one of us. And as a result, it's important for ourselves to ask, how are we feeling? How are things going? How are we responding? But perhaps most importantly of all, we should ask, what are we doing? Shabbat Shalom.